So during the Christmas season, you're going to be around people who know nothing of Christ, know nothing of what this story is about, know nothing of their need for this Savior. That may be a friend, that may be a fellow worker, that may be a family member. And it's just so tempting to be preachy. People don't come to your house for a Christmas party to hear you preach at them. Uh, I think there are ways that we can do that that are offensive and, and maybe lack the themes of the mercy of this story. What I would suggest is how about doing everything you can to incarnate the love of Jesus in your responses to those people? How about being an example of his mercy, an example of his grace, an example of his forgiveness? I love this moment in 1 Peter 3 where it talks about someone coming to a believer asking him about the hope that is in him. Now think about this. It's a person needing evangelism going to the evangelist. Why? Because they've seen something in his life. Wouldn't it be wonderful at Christmas for you to live such a beautiful, loving, gracious life that in the midst of this season, someone would say to you, what makes you tick? You're so patient, you're so kind, you're so loving. And that would be a platform now for talking about the coming of Jesus to somebody who actually is hungry to hear the message. Make your life preach so you have opportunities to tell the story.